Welcome to Hand Tips from Exploring Hand Therapy. Today's tip, we're going to look at an x-ray and see what you know. Okay, on this x-ray, we see that it's an elbow. We see that there is a fracture of the radial head. Now looking at this other x-ray, this is the same patient. We see some concerns on the ulna. Now looking at both of these combined, what are you going to determine? Patient has a lot of complaints of elbow and wrist pain. Of course they do, because it's an Essex Lopresti injury. What that is, is a comminuted fracture of the radial head with a dislocation of the distal radial ulnar joint, which you could clearly see both of those in the x-ray. What you can't see on the x-ray is that there's an actual interosseous membrane disruption as well. If this injury is not found when it's acute, the patient may develop severe wrist pain from radial migration and subluxation. There may be a loss of forearm pronation, supination, as well as extension. Late reconstruction, which is greater than four weeks of radial instability, is going to end up with some bad results. However, when this is recognized early, the problem may be prevented or at least lessened by having an anatomic fracture fixation or by having the radial head replaced. That's it, and we have a Coban wrap. Have a great day. Thanks.